estamos en la planta de Clement Fruit, a las afueras de Oslo, donde la basura de la ciudad, así como de otros países, se convierte en electricidad y energía. Os lo contamos. Uh, this is a telemetry plant and it's, it's a part of the, of the waste handling system in Oslo. We have three uh, incinerators and basically they, uh, these incinerators uh, burn rest waste, mm -hmm. residual waste, and, um, and recover the heat from the, from the incineration uh, to district heating for, for the buildings in Oslo and also electricity. Mm -hmm. La planta de Clemesburg recibe 300.000 toneladas de basura al año. Se separan los desechos orgánicos con los que se va a elaborar biocombustible y también los plásticos que van a ser reciclados. Todo ello mediante un sistema robotizado de varias fases. Los desechos residuales pasan a la incineradora cuyas paredes compuestas por tuberías calientan el agua del sistema de calefacción de la ciudad. Además, el vapor que genera es convertido en electricidad mediante una turbina. It's mainly industrial waste, uh, which basically means uh, waste from uh, from industry or from other uh, municipalities uh, that we are uh, we're basically trading with waste. So, the waste holders have to pay to in order to get rid of their waste. So we. Um, we are selling a treatment for the waste. Mm -hmm. Sweden sold their treatment services uh, much, much cheaper. Yeah. So the waste holders had to pay less in okay. order to get rid of their waste. Mm -hmm. And uh, that is still the situation uh, pretty much. A lot, uh, a lot of uh, Norwegian waste mm -hmm. uh, is crossing the border and is being treated in Sweden. Mm -hmm. And that is uh, it's not uh, good for uh, for the environment because uh, it's it's so cheap to uh, to energy recover it that it's not uh, worthwhile to uh, sort the waste and material uh, or to recycle it. Pero además esta planta se enfrenta a otro reto y es el de las altas emisiones de CO2. We are an environmentally friendly industry because the energy we produce here uh, replaces uh, fossil fuel emissions today. We are doing uh, our best at uh, limit, limiting them and uh, we're now working on capturing CO2 so to limit our emissions totally. Succeeding with that, we will uh, also succeed in making a vital uh, contribution to the global uh, climate initiative.